And speaking of elections, the Arkansas governor's race is heating up. And last night we heard from all four candidates on the Democratic side during a public forum held in Fort Smith. The Democratic Party of Sebastian County hosted the meeting both in person and on Zoom, giving voters a chance to hear from all four candidates vying for the Democratic nomination for governor in 2022, each sharing a message about what's most important about their race for governor. Honesty. Uh, the one thing that I, more than anything, beyond any platform, find any buzzwords or anything else, honesty. I'm running for governor for the people. I mean, I'm not running for party, politics. It's about serving the people. The meeting served as an introduction for the candidates. One question that came up multiple times last night, how the candidates would work with lawmakers across the aisle. The thing that I want folks to take away is that uh, we can win if we act as one team. I mean, we saw it. <laughs> look, we saw it on Saturday with Arkansas against Texas. We have way too many folks on the sidelines. That's what I'm running for. I'm running for governor because I believe that it is uh, is our opportunity. This is our moment to actually put change to action. Well, meanwhile, two candidates are vying for the Republican nomination with the race drawing a lot of attention already. The candidates are former White House Secretary Sarah Sanders and current Attorney General Leslie Rutledge, who's serving her second and final term in that position. And running for the Libertarian nomination, we have Ricky Dale Harrington Jr. He challenged Tom Cotton for his Senate seat in 2020. Right now, he is the only candidate for the Libertarian Party's nomination.